happy moment students welcome to guest class our second school online classes last class we have discussed about what is a average atomic mass of how to calculate the average atomic mass of the elements so today we are going to see about molecule and the classification of molecules and relative molecular mass molecules this is the definition yes a molecule is a combination of two or more atoms held together by strong chemical forces of attraction that is chemical bonds the smallest particle of the substance that retains the chemical and the physical properties of the substance and is a group of two or more atoms that is molecules for example hydrogen molecule consists of two atoms of hydrogen so this is the definition of the molecules so classification of molecules there are two types of molecules one is homo atomic molecule the another one is hetero atomic molecule the first one is homo atomic molecule this means if the molecules if the if the molecule is made of similar kind of atoms then it is called homo atomic molecules the second one is hetero atomic molecules hetero atomic molecules b molecule that consists of atoms of different elements different elements that is hetero atomic molecules homo atomic molecules is a similar kind of atoms that is hydrogen the hetero atomic molecule is sulfuric acid carbon di carbon monoxide glucose these are the examples of hetero atomic molecules fluorine nitrogen chlorine bromine these are the examples of homo atomic molecules these two homo atomic molecule and hetero atomic molecules is further divided into four that is what is mono atomic di atomic tri atomic and poly atomic also we discussed about in what is mono atomic di atomic tri atomic and poly atomic di mono means mono atomic the first one is mono atomic mono means one so only one kind of atoms are contains the elements that is called mono atomic so suppose similar kind of atoms in the mono atomic elements that is homo monoatomic molecules so then now 
thermo atomic molecules heterotomic atomic molecules so two types of this in the two types we vandu further divide aagudhu enna na mono atomic diatomic triatomic polyatomic so enna na same kind of atoms irundhu only one ore ore idu mattum namakku enna idu ore ore molecule mattum irundhuchuna adhu enna solluvena homo mono atomic molecules मालिकोमिक Suppose different kinds of elements. Abdi in that, I am going to tell you. That only one kind of atoms. Abdi in that, I am going to tell you. That two monoatomic molecules. Next is two molecules. I am going to tell you. I am going to tell you. That two diatomic molecules. Next is three. Three in that, I am going to tell you. That two triatomic molecules. More than three in that. ट्रैटमिक This means three. Next one is polyatomic. That is what is. More than three. So this is the classification of elements. So the number of atoms present in the molecules that is called atomicity. Atomicity. What is this? The number of atoms present in the molecule is called as atomicity. So the number of atoms present in the molecules. How much the atoms is present in the molecules? That is called atomicity. So you will write in the answer sheet you know, this sentence. Okay. So this is the atomicity and number of atoms present. So only one atom is present. So it is atomicity is one. So the name is mono atomic so next one is what number of uh, two atoms is present so the atomicity is two and the name is diatomic because it two atoms is present the next one is three three means a tri so tri atomic the atomicity is three more than three that is called polyatomic so the atomicity is More than three. This is the classification of molecules. For example, we will consider the hydrogen gas. It is exists in the two allotropic forms. That is, hydrogen two and hydrogen three. So, two atoms of 
present other as we can two and as we can three so it is the atomicity is two okay because two atoms are present so these two atoms are same hydrogen and hydrogen so it is the what is that thermo atomic molecules okay but it is what is that o2 o2 is a what is it two appa two means di same similar kind of atoms and di atomic so this is the hydrogen two called as homo di atomic molecules because same the same kind of atoms and there are two atoms is present so this is called what is homo di atomic the another is o3 that is ozone ozone like it okay appa and that is in it there is three hydrogen is same kind of atoms are appa three na enna varum tri varum okay appa same kind of atoms are appa enna solluvom the homo tri atomic molecules okay so next example is hydrogen h2 h2 2 is the suffix okay so there are two atoms is present the hydrogen atoms there are similar kind of atoms so it is called as homo di atomic molecules the next one is uh, for example nitrogen fluorine chlorine bromine and iodine these are the examples of homo di atomic molecules so next one is uh, let us consider here hydrogen chloride the next one is uh, hydrogen chloride there are two different element is present in the molecules that is hydrogen and chloride so this is called the what is the hetero atomic molecules hetero atomic molecules this is the atomicity is 2 2 means di so it is called as Di atomic molecules. So hydrogen chloride is called as a two di atomic molecules because two different elements is present and the atomicity is two. So two di atomic molecules. So the next one is. water molecule h2o so there are two different elements hydrogen and hydrogen protein the water molecules so this is the atomicity is 3 so it is called as what is water water there are two different elements are present so it is called hydro So there are atoms in this three because three atoms is present. Three means tri. So tri atomic molecules. So this is the classification of molecules. So I refer to book page number ninety five. Activity seven point one and seven point two. It is M F four. Okay, so it is very very simple. So activity seven point two. Some of the elements are given at 
it is identical to H2 or homoatomic molecules. So you classify in the uh, homo diatomic molecules or di um, homo diatomic molecules or homo polyatomic molecules. Or some of the elements are H2 diatomic molecules or H2 triatomic molecules or H2 polyatomic molecules. Activity 7.1 and 7.2 and homework is done. And the table card is done. This is done. This is done. Observation of the right panel. Activity 7.1 is done. If you have a element, you can use proton silver, neutron silver, mass number, atomic mass. And we have atomic mass. So, this is done. So, this is done. This is done. This is done. This is done. Observation of the right panel. This is done. Next is we have a book relative molecular mass. How to we calculate the relative atomic mass? Same for the relative molecular mass. The definition of this relative molecular mass is the relative molecular mass of a molecule is the ratio between the mass of one molecule of the substance to one by twelve mass of an atom of carbon. For this is the definition for the relative molecular mass. But this is simplified. R M M R means relative. M means molecular. M means mass. Relative molecular mass. So, for example, how to calculate the relative molecular mass? Relative molecular mass of sulfuric acid H two S O four. H two two means suffix. S O four means the form is sufficient. It is calculated as follows. Sulfuric acid contains two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of sulfur and four atoms of hydrogen. So, the relative molecular mass of sulfuric acid is two. Two means two atoms into mass of hydrogen plus one, one means how much the atoms is present in the substance. Okay, so one into mass of sulfur plus four into mass of hydrogen. So two into mass of the hydrogen is one plus one into mass of the sulfur is 32. So the mass of this uh, mass of the element is present in the periodic table. Okay. Next plus four into mass of oxygen is 60. So total 98. So 98 is the molecular mass of the sulfuric acid. So The sulfuric acid is 98 times as heavy as one by twelve of the mass of the carbon twelve. The next one is relative molecular mass of the water is calculated as follows. A water molecule is made up of two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. So the relative molecular mass of the water is two because Two atoms contains in the hydrogen atom. So two into mass of hydrogen plus one because one atoms contains in the oxygen atom in the water molecule. So one into mass of hydrogen. So so two into one plus one into sixteen that is eighteen. So the water molecule is eighteen times the heavy than the one by twelve of the mass of the Carbon twelve. So this is the measure to the relative molecular mass. If the molecular mass of the compound is expressed in grams, that is called the gram molecular mass. How to measure the atomic mass is? 
extra things is gram so that is called what is uh, gram atomic mass same for the gram molecular mass it is expressed in grams so it is called uh, gram molecular mass gram molecular mass that is is the molecular mass of the mass of the compound which expressed in grams that is called the gram molecular mass so the gram molecular mass of water is 18 gram molecular mass of water is 18 before we calculate the molecular mass of water so 18 it is expressed in gram so it is 18 gram the carbon dioxide gram molecular mass of ammonia is what is this 17 gram gram molecular mass of the carbon dioxide is 44 gram gram molecular mass of hcl hydrochloric acid acid is 36.5 gram so this is the what is a gram molecular mass first we calculate the what is this relative molecular mass and after the this expressed in the gram that is gram molecular mass so next we have discussed about what is the what is the difference between atoms and molecules atoms an atom is the smallest particle of an element molecule a molecule is the smallest particle of the element of compound as we we have discussed what is uh, what is atom and what is molecule so adha vechu da inda difference undu and we shall make the okay va the second one is atom does not exist in free state except in a noble gas the next one is molecule exists in free state except the some of the noble gas other atoms are highly reactive but the molecule is less reactive atoms does not have a chemical bond the atoms in a molecule are held by a chemical bonds this is the difference between the atoms and molecules so today class we have discussed about what is this what is molecules and the classification of molecules how to calculate the relative molecular mass for different what is relative molecular mass this topic of today class we have discussed thank you